In today's episode, we'll continue on in the series that we're calling our Latitude Adjustment. We'll make our last stop in the Eastern Caribbean with a visit to beautiful St. Lucia. If you've been following this series, you'll remember that we're avoiding those winter doldrums by crisscrossing the Caribbean. We've been hiking and paddling and diving as many of the islands as we can. A change in latitude and attitude seems to be just what we needed. We spent our last episode exploring the island of Barbados. Then, last night, we traveled 100 miles west and arrived here at the neighboring island of St. Lucia. St. Lucia is part of the Windward Islands of the Lesser Antilles. It's a pretty large island with over 200 square miles and about 200,000 residents. We're spending time in the island's largest and busiest place, the capital city of Castries. This island gets well over a million visitors annually, and there is much for tourists and divers to enjoy. But we want to spend our time underwater. We've heard that St. Lucia's reefs are home to a huge collection of barrel sponges. And here's an example of what we're talking about. We've seen these all over the Caribbean, but they're reported to be really big here and can be found in large numbers. Today we'll be diving with local operator Scuba Steves, and I bet they can put us on those sponge fields. The dive master will be taking us to these two dive sites. Both are over here on the west side of the island. Over there on the right is our friend Joe. Joe is a talented musician, a master diver, and an all-around great guy. He's joining the RUS channel today on St. Lucia's Reefs, and will join in on the hunt for those giant barrel sponges. We'll start our quest with a little run through this cool channel. Joe is giving us the hand signal for an eel, so let's see what he's found. This is Gymnothorax moringa, or the spotted moray eel. Usually these guys are tucked back in holes, so it's pretty cool to see one out in the daylight hunting. This is a Dasiatus americana, or the southern stingray. She's buried herself in the sand, but her whip tail seems to be pointing us toward a large collection of giant barrel sponges. Let's see what's over there. Thank you. 
some of those big sponges were so large that I could have easily fit inside. This dive in St. Lucia was full of color and representative of the type of diving that the Eastern Caribbean offers. Thanks to Scuba Steves and their great dive crew for showing us around. So, what's up next? Well, we've wrapped up our journey through the Eastern Caribbean and we'll be heading west. Our next episode will find a snorkeling and shooting video way over on the Mexican island of Cozumel. You'll want to check that out. If you like this type of content, please consider subscribing to our channel. Thanks again, and we'll join you soon for more videos of the two of us exploring the wonderful world that's around us. We'll see you next time from sunny Cozumel when our latitudes and attitudes get some needed adjusting.